Hello, everybody. I'm going to show you how to create a QR code and then go back and check the status of it. Log into your uh, OES and then on the left hand side, click on O Trim. On this page, the top left is the long URL that you want to shorten. Underneath that is the desired name you want to put on the short URL. And then to the right of that is the alias. If you'd like to add an alias to like uh, YouTube Onet or something. Now click on trim link. You're going to come to this page. This page is asking you, do you want to enable OTP per view? No. The only time you need to do that is if you're sending it in an email so you don't get in trouble. But if you're posting it, no problem. Okay, here, top left will be the long URL. The one to the right of that is the short URL that you just made. To the right of that is the alias. And if you look at all the icons, the second from the last on the right is the QR code. Click it. There's your QR code. You go, you download it, you can put it on anything you want. And when people put a phone on it, boom, baby, they go to the site that you want. Okay, on this page, the third icon over from the trimmed URL, you're going to see it'll say dashboard, click it. It's going to take it to here, where it shows you everywhere that that QR code or that uh, trimmed URL was clicked, what country, how many times. And if you scan down, it'll show you what devices everything that you would want to know about that URL, QR code, or the trim will tell you everything about it, the history of where it's been in the world. 